Hello. 2019 Hyundai Kona 1.6L Triple AWD. Meet the strongest recent entry in the subcompact, tall think class. Perched up on its wheels, with a distinct forward cant that gives it the impression of a puppy excitedly leaning in to lick your face, the Hyundai Kona is easy to like. Its eye-catching embarrassment of forward lighting reaches is attractively arranged and is matched by the rear ends similarly stacked upper and lower lighting elements. For the record, the pair of eyebrows situated over the square-shaped headlights are LED running lamps, while fog lamps live in those hexagonal gashes in the lower intake. High powerful engine, refined handling, tons of character. Lows costly turbo powertrain, limited cabin storage. Given that the Kona is a small crossover competing in a segment for which America has developed a growing dependency, it also wears black plastic fender flares and bumpers to finish off the earth and incursion vehicle vibe. It all adds up to a better looking alternative to the hot selling, vaguely outdoors Subaru cross track with which it directly competes. Choosing the lime twist paint that glowed like radiation from our coconut test car also unlocks the option for color matched trim in the mostly black cabin, which has a quality feeling. A straightforward to use touch screen flanked by physical shortcut buttons to access key menus sits high up on the dashboard. Below, there are the climate controls and a small phone shaped tray that, on top ultimate models, contains an inductive charging pad. Soft touch materials cover most of the dashboard and the upper halves of the front door panels, but move rearward in the cabin and, as if typical in this class, that squish gives way to starch. The hard plastics are nicely grained, however, and every elbow meets a padded armrest. Rear seat space is tighter than in the larger cross track its wheelbase is 2.5 inches longer than the Kona's although not untenably so. Subjectively, the Kona's comfortable front and rear seats feel on the more spacious end of this class. Its 19 cubic feet of cargo space behind the rear seats is just 2 cubes shy of the Sabellers. Brace thyself, things Kona get. Sporty? So that's all fine, the style and usefulness and such. But the Kona delivers on deeper planes, too. Beneath its clothing, components gathered from throughout Hyundai's automotive empire are assembled into a fun, refined package. Among tallish subcompact hatchback CR crossovers nothing comes close. Not even the fun to drive Mazda CX-3 or the 10 best winning KIA Soul. Have you actually seen the war-driven Mitsubishi Outlander Sport or a Chevrolet Trax? We rest our case. Take the Pater Family S Kona Ultimate tested here. It's 175 HP turbocharged 1.6 liter inline 4 and 7 speed dual clutch automatic transmission rank as more powerful and complex than nearly everything else in the subcompact crossover space. The powertrain is shared with the Kona Limited, and both are distinguished visually from the Southeast and SCL models by their natty 18 inch wheels and some additional chrome trim. Those lesser trims are powered by a more class standard 147 HP naturally aspirated 2.0 liter 4 and conventional 6 speed automatic. Front wheel drive is standard across the lineup, an all wheel drive that can be locked into a 50 over 50 front slash rear torque split is available for $1,300. We've neither driven nor tested a Kona with the weaker engine but our experience with the same 2.0 liter in other Hyundais suggests it should be entirely serviceable, if unexciting. Besides, the Kona Southeast starts at just $20,480, and the $22,130 SCL ranks as a genuine bargain given its standard 7.0-inch touchscreen.
blind spot monitoring, heated front seats, proximity key entry with push button ignition, and 17 inch wheels. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and share.